A livestock market at Circle, animals feed in filth, and the drains are choked with silt and animal droppings. The goat on the drain. Who is this goat owner? If the owner is not the hair, chair, remove it. If there's no owner, remove it and go and put it in the car. Please, where, is, where are the others? Sami. Sami. They should remove all the goat on the drain. Florence Kuchi is the director of the AMA Sanitation Department and she's after the owner of the shop. But no one will own up. She decides to seize the animals. So, and you, the you owner to... was standing here, but he said the owner is not there. So when we started, so that is the tricks we were with. When you go to a place and you cannot identify the owner, if there is an asset there, try to take over the asset. You see the owner. You see when we start to just remove one uh, sheep, the owner came out. He was standing here, he said he wasn't the owner. Now he is the owner. So it's very difficult. But does this really not point to the fact that the Operation Clean Up Fronted campaign has not gone down to the last person who must hear it? Massa, the Operation Clean Up Frontage campaign has gone down, but it's just, a, what would I say, a human attitude, a Ghanaian attitude towards sanitation. That is the problem. Everybody knows what to do, but they don't want to do it. When they see you, they'll tell you they've been doing it. You see, he said they've been doing it every day. What shows that this thing they removed it last week? Hmm? So everybody knows what to do, but everybody's refusing to do what they are supposed to do. It turns into an argument which is quickly resolved. Now, they have to clean the entire place. <laughs> It's an insult. How can you be working here? This is where you eat. You sit here, you live all your life here. You only go home after 8 o'clock. And latest by 6 o'clock, you are here. And you inhale this thing throughout. Why can't you keep the place neat? When you go to elsewhere, it's not like that. Why is our own different? Now, at least they, they, they seem to have gotten the notice from the AMA. They have started some cleaning works here. Uh, Desilting the drain that lies in front of them. According to the Operation Clean of Fronted Tenants, everybody was responsible for the piece of land, including drains that lie just in front of their edifice, be it your workplace or your home. And like this one, you are supposed to be responsible for this drain. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Please, after that, remove the pallets from the drain. Madam, you tell us we're here. Yes, so we Would want to do the work together. We want to do it together. I want to help you do it. So remove the pallets. We're here. We will do it. We will do it. We do it like that. So we beg, we beg, we beg you very much. We beg you do it. Eh? Yeah. The concern is they are leaving the waste, the sales that they've collected from the drain onto the shoulders of the street. What is going to happen to this? Let's ask uh, Asitanga who is with the AMA. What is that is going to happen? Mr. Asitanga, so this way that you are leaving here, mm -hmm. what is going to happen? We are not leaving anything here. Nothing is going to be left here. We are going to ensure that they are the perpetrators of the field that they generated here and they will be they are responsible to collect it for safe disposal and whatever will cost for it will cost them to collect the the the, the cell that they've worked on they will bear the cost of it and take it away it's been an eventful day at the livestock market here near Aveno under the ECG pylons here uh, very close to circle we'll ask Florence now they are truck is here to collect the waste that was removed from the drains. In fact, today's exercise has been one of the successful exercises that we've done. We've been able to complete the cycle. We started with the Sultan, now we are loading into a skip container for it to take away. There's no going to be a way that we'll leave this thing here. But we are not just leaving them to go. We have served them with summons because they have caused the mess. They shouldn't wait for us to come and tell them to clean before they clean. So we've served them summons uh, and notices 
three abatement notices. And it shows that when next we come and we see anything of such, we don't need to give them any abatement notice. We are running out with a sermon, so nobody will complain that nobody has been here. Officers have been here a series of times, but they refuse to comply. Under the operation clean your frontage tenants, you are expected to clean your immediate environment. Failure to do that, you are going to be seeing men and women in reflectors from the AMA or from local assembly who will come to serve you notice. I don't think you want that. Make sure you are doing what's right. For Joy News, Michael Ashale. Thank you very much. We are so grateful.